the scientific consensus could hardly be louder or clearer. Without far-reaching changes to how we live, humanity faces a potential climate catastrophe during the lifetime of many of us or our children. Greenhouse gas emissions are linked to extreme climate and weather events, with increasingly devastating consequences for both people and the planet. Floods, fires, droughts, polluted air and water scarcity are merely the most obvious blights we're already suffering. More positively, though, governments, corporations, and the public are showing greater awareness than ever before, as well as determination to tackle the issues. Technological solutions are increasingly viable. As a result, the drive to secure a more sustainable future is intensifying. We call this critical process greening the world, and we believe it to be an unstoppable trend. Greening the world represents an unprecedented challenge for society. Last year, we highlighted the progress of clean energy, which has become significantly cheaper. However, we still have far to go to reduce our reliance on fossil fuels, as recent events have graphically reminded us. As the global economy reopened in 2021, energy shortages have seen prices shoot up, with some countries even resorting to burning more coal, the dirtiest fuel of all. Nevertheless, we remain optimistic about the road ahead. Around the world, a major expansion of green infrastructure is in store, with governments committed to invest trillions of dollars. Over the next 10 years, additions to global electric capacity from wind and solar is set to be two and a half times greater than in the prior 20 years, even after the heavy spending of the last decade. Much of this will occur in Asia, a region that is currently a heavy carbon emitter. While clean energy and electrification are essential to greening the world, they are by far no means the full story. Securing a more sustainable future also demands action in many other spheres of the economy and everyday life. For example, agriculture and food production are also sources of emissions, as are other important processes, such as making cement. But in these areas too, we see the beginnings of a transformation, with new technologies helping to create meat substitutes and less energy-intensive building materials. As public awareness grows and regulations tighten, we believe that further progress will follow. Greening the world is an inherently disruptive process, with companies either having to adapt to the new realities or be displaced. This has equally important implications for investors who own or lend to those companies. We continue to envision a future where clean energy assets outperform fossil fuel assets despite the latter's recent rally. We also favor the makers of innovative technologies that enable more sustainable food, water preservation, and purification, and greener building materials. Another potential opportunity, and one that may get overlooked, exists in sectors and companies that might adopt these technologies most effectively. Likewise, we see possibilities in carbon allowances, which allow investors to get direct exposure to an important part of the drive towards lower emissions. A greener world is critical to our collective well-being. It also has the power to shape our wealth. <laughs>